Welcome back to the show. I'm your host, Tammy Brown. I'm here at BRCC's Process Technology Program, and I'm with the program manager of the Process Technology uh, Program here, Mr. Russell Hills. Mr. Hills, thank you so much for being on the show. You're welcome. Okay, uh, now process technology, for those out there, students that may be interested in this uh, program, I know it's a two-year program, and it's associate degree, is it? That is correct, right, two-year uh, associate degree. And we hear a lot about that now because we have all these plants, uh, you know, in this area, and they're hiring process operators and technicians. That's correct. Right. What exactly do they do in this field? Okay, a process operator, this is individuals who actually are responsible for doing all of the manufacturing products within the chemical plants refinery. These are individuals who are responsible for the gasoline that you use, the motor oil that you put in cars, and uh, many of your household products to you use. Uh, these individuals are responsible for manufacturing the material. Now, when they go into, like I said, they come enroll, enroll in this program and they don't know anything about plants or uh, anything, all this equipment behind us, Will they still be successful if they have no background in this field? Sure they will. Again, we try to prepare them here, but uh, I'd like to tell most students, uh, when I was originally hired on the Exxon, I knew absolutely nothing about plant operations and had a pretty prosperous career there. So again, we try to give them some of the basics here within the program to get them on their feet, but uh, absolute knowledge of the plant, uh, that's something that's not necessary to need. Uh, again, we try to prepare them for basic knowledge, and once you get in the plant, they will um, uh, acquire the uh, remaining knowledge that, uh, that's needed. And it's an associate degree program. It is associate degree, right. Uh, again, associate of applied science for process technology. And I noticed that uh, you sp we spoke earlier that there's an intern sh a program attached to the curriculum, so students go to work. That's correct. We, uh, as, as a matter of fact, we actually partner with uh, several plants, that, uh, many of the plants on advisory board, and some of them also serve as uh, intern specialists for us. So again, uh, at the end of each program, uh, during the last semester here, we actually uh, have what we call intern pro uh, internship. Uh, those plants come in, they interview our students, and they're hired on as an internship uh, at this point in time, pretty much for the whole semester. It gives them an opportunity to find out whether or not the work is for them, but also gives the plant an opportunity to look at the student to determine whether not the student will fit their culture. During this last semester, for the most part, we uh, pretty much had almost an eighty percent retention with our, our students uh, in our district at this point in time from internship. That's a great. That's a great number. They're eighty percent, and also uh, the tuition I know is a approximately eighteen hundred dollars per semester, which is nominal simply because we do have financial aid available for students and student loans for those who need that. We are now enrolling for the uh, fall semester. Is that correct? We are enrolled for the fall semester. Correct. Uh, and uh, the point I didn't hit upon as well is it is also a great career if you want to go in because. It's it's one of those careers that you can, in fact, uh, start off making a minimum of $55,000 a year uh, as a first year, you know, uh, higher even within the plants or whatever. So it's a very lucrative career uh, for, uh, like I said, for the short amount of education that, that's required for the two-year program. Absolutely. Starting at 55 a year and only in school for two years, you can't beat that. Tuition 1800 a semester. We're now enrolling. Mr. Hills here will be one of your instructors. And look, he's great. He broke it down to me, explain, you know, how uh, process technicians work, how Everything you do as a technician is pretty much what goes on in everyday life, too. You that just don't correct. realize that. So he said you come with background already. He's going to get you to where you need to be. Mr. Hills, thank you so much for being on the show. And you guys, if you're interested in enrolling, go to the mybrcc.edu website. And we have an online application. You don't have to get in line. You can do it online. We'll see you soon.